return on the YouTube page and click in this video, I'll make, I'll compose a tune. For that compose the tuner, we'll add some raw beats and uh, we'll make uh, some chord progressions with the strings and I make some uh, piano arpeggiations and as usual the bass guitar part. Okay, let's start the video. Let me open my DAW FL Studio 12 producer version. And uh, I'm going to compose a tune which is my own composition, my own song uh, which got released in the year 2017. It's a Kannada song but however now it's not a matter of uh, thinking whether it is a Kannada or anything else. Just uh, you need to learn how to make a song uh, include, uh, using some of the plugins. Okay, let's start it with. Uh, so let me select the BPM tempo for that. It is uh, 120 I'm going to select. Actually the original song composition was in 125. So let me go for 120. Okay, I'm going to play my composed tune. Hope you will like it. Okay, this is my composed song. I think you may not like the song immediately because once after uh, making someone to sing the song, once if you add the lyrics for the song, once it comes with a vocal part, I think then uh, and repetition, come to, uh, repeat, repeatedly hearing the song may may make you to like this song. Okay, no problem. This was my composed tune. Uh, so give me two minutes of time. I just fast forward this video uh, to arrange the timing song all perfectly. Yes, thanks for your time. Okay, now I have my tune with the uh, 120 tempo. Okay, I have composed it and uh, for this I think uh, we need to create a rhythm now. So I'm going to create an uh, inbuilt rhythm which uh, I have already. So I'm going to open one of my contact file. Uh, okay, from this contact file, I'm going to select my drum lab. Okay, this is my drum lab plug plugin. I think in this one I have uh, got some of like I have got three toms, one kong, sticks, a go goes, hi hats, snares, kick, and crashes and red hats. Uh, so I'm going to just mic uh, some uh, loops here. Okay, this is sounding good. Now I have a groove for myself uh, that is uh, raw. I think I'm going to select uh, an aggressive break is a sub selection from here. I'm going to just switch it out. And in between of in between the hook part, I'm going to select something else. I think raw is selected and let it be raw only. I think I'm going to change the uh, like aggressive break to uh, electro boom. Okay, from there I'm going to select uh, another thing from my aggressive break to dead to dry. It's a different thing. It is going to sound like this. Uh, let's listen the groove. Okay, the, both the loops are recorded. I think the, for, the, for the first uh, uh, one third of a part, uh, it is recorded with the raw an aggressive break and the second part of a hook is recorded with the raw and dead dry 
Uh, so the third part, I think I'm going to change it again. So I'm going to select it from the dead drive to so far. I think here you can see the fifth option so far. I think I'm going to select. So let's uh, listen to this loop now. Okay, fine. This is a three loops I recorded now. And let's do one more loop I'm going to do. I think uh, I'm not going to record this separately because for that I'm going to just uh, uh, keep the same one, the first one, aggressive break. Yes, let it be this the same thing. So three loops have been recorded uh, from my DAW for the first, uh, uh, first, uh, you know, first hook part. Uh, let's see. Now I'll just give you two minutes of time. I'll just arrange them everything and I'll make you to listen how it's going to sound with my loops for my composition okay now i'm going to listen my tune listen it here Uh, after making okal to be sung there then I think uh, that is going to color like anything so now it's just it sounds like a little boring also and already I have a sung part of this I have a singer for the song and he has already sung so let me show you uh, let me make it hear how it uh, sounds uh, singing for this tune <laughs> Also, polyphonies we have not added, or any other uh, BGM instrument like we have we have not added. So let's try it now. I'm going to add some of the instruments now for the same tune. So I think first I'm going to add the chords for this. So I have this is my own composed song. So I have got uh, some list of chords to it sounds good for this song. So for that chord, I'm opening one of the contact player and one of the plugin. There I'm opening the Infinitize Edge. Infinitize Edge. This this plugin I'm going to open. And with this plugin, I think I'm going to make chords, I mean basic chords, I can say it. Let me see how it sounds, first of all. Uh, this is a little mix of, you know, alien chords, we can say, a little mix of string chords. Yeah, a little, if you go as much as you bass, it sounds too scary. So let's be on the top edge, I mean, the, just like on the middle of it, so that uh, something will be good to hear it, I think, okay? Uh, so fine then let me create a, a pattern for this and keep a name string cards and how it sounded na 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 when it sounded like this uh, I think uh, na na on the first beat only the tune is going to start so maybe on the first beat uh, I'm going to put a C minor seventh chord however it is in a C minor scale C minor harmonic. 
chord I'm going to show. So the notes are C, E flat, G, and B flat. And then this is what I'm going to do it. So let me record it for the first chord. So after recording, I can I no need to record the next chords. I can just edit in the MIDI file. Okay, I just recorded the chord thing. So give me time to arrange this. And after arranging, I have I have to make a separate mixer channel for this. So let me name this alien string here also. After making it here, I will root this to the mixer here, and I'll keep the volume down because it is sounding more now. So let it sound like only. Now this is good. I think now this is sounding good actually. Okay, so the remaining chords I will plot it now. So give me uh, just thirty seconds of time. I'm just going to compose the fully chords for this song. Okay, now I have arranged the chords. I think for uh, the eight bars. So eight bars chords going to sound like this. I'm going to play this. I show you so I think this also act as a pad instead of chord so I think fine this kind of little little chord chord thing so this I call string alien chords and from next part I think I'll after eight bars I'm going to add some other style of adding chords and so let me stop this alien string chords now those there after this uh, I can just add I think uh, from my system you can see I have seen a baujuki kind of an uh, instrument uh, so it's going to sound like this I think this sounds like a good like a chords, like exact chords than alien strings. So I think so this is going to enter. So from which part you know I'm going to from this part. Yes, from this point I think I'm going to add the chord. So give me some time again. I'm going to arrange all the chords and those things. So I'm going to start with the E flat major chord actually. recorded the chords for the first only first bar I think in this one what I have done uh, for the bass you can see for this E flat major chord on the second octave of my uh, MIDI keyboard I have uh, sustained the chord notes for whole bar but the above also you can see the high end thing I am going to and sustaining like this that on the only on the first beat I have made E flat G and the second beat I have made E flat major chord and the third beat I am not playing anything I have made a blank and the fourth beat again I have made a uh, another again E flat major chord so it is going to sound like this now so this is how I'm going to make it again so this is the chord pattern or structure I'm going to follow so give me 30 seconds of time I'm going to arrange all the chords and make it in timings okay thanks for your time now I have arranged both the chords like uh, for the first time I did the alien string chords and now I did both three chords no? so just I have arranged the chords and the timings and everything so from first we'll listen how it is sounding now